So I'm going to go over the camera and the quality of the camera. One, it has a pretty much all metal body. This is going to be metal and this black piece right here is going to be completely metal. The camera lens is going to be made out of glass and then the top here is going to be plastic. This white top piece and this bottom piece is pure plastic. You can actually pop this off here. This piece right here is a hundred percent plastic. That's about the only plastic piece on it. And you can hear it, it's plastic. But the whole entire metal around this camera, this is all metal. So you have a complete metal camera besides a few pieces of the plastic here. And that just clamps back on this uh, camera somehow. Like this, you just, you can snap it snap it right back in place there and it goes right back in now this camera is going to be 1080p at 30 frames it's a 2 megapixel camera and if I did not tell you it is analog so it hooks to an analog DVR and what you get right here is a pack of screws some anchors this connector to so connect two wires together and a uh, Allen wrench in here to adjust the camera and just a book and you get a sticker right here that helps line up when you go to put the holes in that's all you get in there and this is what the box looks like that's pretty much it let's go ahead and plug it in and see how it looks so for the price I pay for these it was like $25 these are pretty good cameras. They're pretty clear in the daytime and they're pretty clear at nighttime. They're not bad at all. These cameras do come bare. No cables, no power supply, no nothing. But if you're already upgrading cameras that you already have, you're going to have the power supply and you're going to have cables already. You can just swap them out and you'll get that clear picture. As you can tell, you can see my face really clear. These are going to be 2 megapixels at 30 frames, 1080p. Coming up here, you're going to see a glare on top of the car. And that's not going to be from the camera. That's going to be from a beam light in my backyard. So the nighttime footage right here, like I said, it looks good. It's totally doable. You can see the car pretty well. And there's that glare I'm talking about from my beam light. If you found this video helpful in any shape or form, go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up. And go check out my YouTube channel for more videos like it. Peace.